so large, we've got an asteroid that now orbits Earth. Um, we then, one of our members linked us to a North Korean nuclear reactor, which we then bought off Gumtree and put it in a caravan. So we now have the universe's first known warp-powered caravan. So, we're going to take you on a test flight. Um, Jose, you get to learn how to fly the ship. <laughs> What's your name? Jonathan. Jonathan. Brilliant. Um, we'll take you to a shooting range where you get to learn how to use the tactical systems. And you're a backup. <laughs> Do not pour any beer into the control consoles. They are very delicate, mainly because I just built them yesterday. Um, so, Jose. Yep. Pitch down the ship, pitch up the ship. Yep. Your left, your right. Yep. So that, yep. and then roll, roll. Okay. Fine lateral movement when you're docking and on docking. Okay, so but that. so, okay, just like that. Yeah. Throttle, charging the jump drive, engines, blast shields, lights, landing gear. Uh, you've seen Stargate, haven't you, Jose? No, no. Um, okay. So basically, um, the jump gates are huge rings in space. Get inside it, come to a complete stop, charge your jump drive, that will then flash, smack it, but don't hit anything. No, no, I repeat that Otherwise, thing. you will die. What is this one for? Charging the hyperspace jump drive. Oh, yeah. So you'll get into the rings, yeah. come to a complete stop inside these big rings, yeah. then charge it. Okay. When it's charged, that will flash. Okay. Hit that. So when it's and off, then when it's off. That's off. That's off. When you're in hyperspace, turn it off. But I'll be jumping in and out and helping you. Tactical. Yeah. Uh, and the 3D radar will explain as well. Tactical. When we get to the shooting range. What's that called? Yeah. When we get to the shooting range, stop pressing buttons. Um, we're going to be firing. Go on, mate. Actually, I'll show you. When we get to the shooting range, your radar will come up like this. Loads of orange dots before you cut it. Their IDs will be here, how far away they are from the ship they're here. They're organised in distance. The ID number is a four digit code. Punch it in here, hit scan. It will scan it and then you'll lock on. On the object, it will flat. It will be an orange square that will spin. When you're locked on, it will be a green static square. Shoot it with one of these. Does it matter which? Doesn't matter, you've got four banks. If you ask Tim for more power, they'll charge faster. You'll also be able to shoot further away. Yep. So they get on the radar, they go green, then orange, then red. On here, if they're grey, you can't even scan them. Yep. You just know they're there. If I can scan them, I can reach them. You can't reach them. Okay, so so, so when if they're green, you've got a chance. When they're orange, you're more than likely. When they're red, you've definitely got to hit them. More power to weapons, you'll, you'll charge faster. More power to scanners, ask Tim again, you'll know more about them. They have fuel and they have hulls. You can hit them but not destroy them, you'll learn about their hulls. It will say beneath the missile on the radar. Also their fuel, if their fuel drops to zero, they explode and they won't hurt us. So if they're like here and they're like fuel two, just ignore it, it's gonna explode, it'll be fine. Okay. Also, what does this word do? They don't do anything. I think yes. it's by itself. Yeah, it's, it's down there. Decoy. Um, it's force back. Decoy, we need to relay to that. It's your smart bombs. If you get overwhelmed and there's a load of missiles here, hit decoy or smart bombs and it'll just annihilate everything there. Cool. cool. If you need to stand up, mind above the uh, earth. Yeah. Could have reset it, Tim. Could have reset it. What is it? What is it? He's over there. You saw nothing. Not a thing. No idea what's going on. If you need to stand up, there is a power conduit above your head, and you know what you're doing. I know. It's exactly the same. Hey, look. Apart from the codes around, they're hey, completely hey, right random. Which it? You know, for oh, all yeah. the codes, they're random. That's Brilliant. Cool. Um, if anything is to go wrong, read your <laughs> screens and talk to each other. Tell each other what to do. Also, listen to him because he's played it before. Last question. The scanning things to know more about them. What's that useful for again? Um, you, if you scan them, you then lock on. You also get to know their, how much hull they've got because they can crash into debris yep. and stuff and get slightly damaged. If they have them on hull, kill them because there is the kill. Yeah, basically. And you'll also know their fuel. 
So pick the weak ones with no hull, ignore the ones with no fuel. Yeah, because they're going to explode anyway when they run out of fuel. Brilliant. Are you there? Activate! <laughs> Activate! So, Tim? Yes, it work. Start the reactor. Tim has the lucky job of looking after us all, maintaining the reactor and making sure we don't suffocate. Turbine cooling rod in ready fuel pump start first stage, primary turbine reactor in ready state. Initiate reactor start. Reactor started. Disconnecting from auxiliary power. Everything's fine. Hi guys, Jose. Pilot, if you want to open your um, blast shields. Yeah, what? The blind. Yeah? Yep. So you want to do blast shield part? Okay, blind shield out. Check it out. Who's the market? Who's the market? Hello, computer. Bay doors are now open and docking clamp is being released. If you want to raise your um, undercarriage and fly us out of here. Let's up and down, yeah? Uh, you're Tim, you're, you're Tim, you're in control. Oh, thank you. Uh, uh, one source, so we just need to go to the uh, and then we just put that uh, engine top. This is just rotten. Landing gear very attracted. Very there we go, we're off. Uh, you need to fly through these waypoints here, through these okay. gates. We don't have to. Oh, we don't have to, okay. We're we'll just guides. Off. So, we need to make our way to the Stargate at the end, which is the big circular one. Um, don't say Stargate, we'll get sued. Uh, yeah, very sorry. The jump gate. Thank you. Um, yeah, get to the middle of the jump gate, and then you need to kill the engines. And then further instructions. Yeah. Oh, first okay. stage come up power transfer system primed. Uh, fuel uh -oh. pump. First stage power turbine cooling rod and fuel pump. First stage primary turbine reactor in ready state. Initiate reactor start. What's going on? Uh, we, I've had to restart the reactor because we've caused a lot of damage. Uh -oh. So let's just wait here for a second. We need to really gently get into the middle of the jump gate. Uh, how is that backwards or what? Okay, so just spin over very, very slowly. Um, we've got to go away from boot up here. Yeah. Like backwards. Because that's the top of the engine. That's why you're here. Whoa, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Right, okay, we stop where we are. Now we need to charge the jump generator. Charge? Yeah. Toggle the engines. Oh, toggle the engines as well. So off and then back on again. So 
waiting. So the lights around here is clear. Get yeah, that out. Jump system. No one can hear you lying. Gravity field detected. Well, yeah, nothing to worry about at all. Everything's fine. Yeah? Damage to jump drive detected. Yeah, okay, maybe not. Oh. Warning, warning. Okay. Shit. We're gonna die. Yeah, we are gonna die. Warning, warning. You have died. Please remain seated until a crew member leads you to your chosen afterlife. 
Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. We, we lost loads of cables, I think. Um, they're just really, really delicate, those ones.